Let's work up our vocal cords a little bit. Slava Ukraini! Slava Ukraini! Slava Ukraini! My name is Justine Toplitsky, and for those of you who were here earlier, yes, it's me, costume change, but I am back to MC the gala show this evening. And we have so much wonderful entertainment coming your way this evening. For 27 years, the Bloor West Village Toronto Ukrainian Festival has been a joyous celebration of the culture, creativity, and collegiality of the Ukrainian and Ukrainian Canadian people. Again this year, against the heartbreaking backdrop of Russia's brutal war on Ukraine, it is more important than ever to share our music, dance, language, and traditions with the world. We take this opportunity to infuse our performances, our exhibits, and all of our festival activities with gratitude for all of the countries, communities, organizations, and individuals who have chosen to stand in solidarity with Ukraine. Before we start tonight's entertainment, uh, the Tor Toronto Ukrainian Festival would like to thank the Bloor West Village BIA for allowing us to use this space, the street, for three full days. A special thank you to our community stage sponsors, Ontario Lottery and Gaming. OLG plays an integral role in communities across Ontario, focusing on partnerships that help make the province a better place to live. To date, OLG has given back more than $50 billion to the province of Ontario. They're proud to help the communities Ontarians call home because they call them home as well. For more information, visit them online at olg.ca. Now we start this evening's gala with a renowned group of singers and bandura players, the bandura being the national instrument of Ukraine. As you can see behind me, the Toronto-based Canadian Bandurist Capella is a male bandurist chorus founded in June of 2001 by a group of like-minded individuals whose goal was to promote Ukrainian music and culture. The group showcases powerful male voices accompanied by the rich sound of the contemporary bandura, the Ukrainian national instrument. Over its 20 plus year history, the capella has performed in venues across Canada and the US, including the CNE and the Dauphin Ukrainian Festival. In May of 2019, the Canadian Bandurist Capella, under the direction of Julian Kataste, musical director, embarked on an ambitious tour of Central and Western Canada. In the fall of 2022, the Canadian Bandurist Capella completed a successful three-city concert series called Stand with Ukraine, in support of and celebrating the heroism of the Ukrainian people against Russian aggression. The Capella has collaborated with many highly acclaimed ensembles and soloists. So please join me in welcoming the Capella. Oh, you. 